hi guys welcome to this lecture in this lecture i'm going to teach you the arithmetic so first of all what is arithmetic arithmetic are just uh, addition subtraction and multiplication that we perform on the variables so now i'm going to add the values i'm going to subtract the values then divide and all these things and now let's start here is first of all here is the document dot ready and from the next video uh, i will already write this thing document dot ready because it is time consuming here is this and this so now here in between this first of all i'm gonna create the variables here is the variable x and here i'm gonna give, give I have given it the value 9 and then here is a y and it have the value 8 and after it I'm going to create another variable here is this and in its name is result and because in this variable I will save the result uh, when we perform the addition multiplication or anything and here is it and now I'm going to add uh, this variable uh, uh, these two variable values and then I will so now I'm gonna add uh, these two variables and then save it in the result and here is here I'm gonna perform it in this uh, line here is equal and x plus y here is y and at the end there is a semicolon so now here you can see that uh, we have add the x and the y so now here you can see that we are adding the x and y so what is happening here this statement is just simple it is just adding the x and the y uh, in reality it is adding the 9 plus 8 so now 9 plus 8 is equal to around about 17 so 17 is stored inside the result and here i want to tell you another thing this this plus sign is operator this is a operator minus is a operator divide is a operator like this is a this is a operator this plus is a operator this divide this these symbols uh, that we use are all the operators so why we call these things operators because uh, by using these uh, signs we can perform the operations we can add the values we can divide the values we can multiply the values we can plus and minus the values and here you see that uh, this this these are the variables and we call these variables operands so why we call the operands here i'm going to write the word because maybe my uh, pronunciation is not correct so here you see that it's uh, we call these variables operands because we the operators are apply on these variables so now these variables are operands these are just terms uh, don't go uh, into many detail of this thing so this is these are just terms to call these things and here i'm gonna print the result here in the div here is first of all we also need to create a div here i have not created a div and here is div here is this div dot it is text and now here i'm gonna write result and now what is going to happen in this div we are going to print this variable we are just printing this variable and here is refresh it so here is the 17 is printed 8 plus 9 is 17 so in this way you can also perform other operations like here i'm gonna get this thing from here i'm gonna remove it from here it's declaration remove from here and declare it here so now uh, in this way you can perform the addition uh, addition and you can also perform the subtraction like this and here is uh, i'm gonna comment it and here is 
1 because 9 minus 8 is equal to 1 in this way you can also perform the multiplication here is 9 multiply 8 is round about 72 and here you see that 72 and you can also perform division and here is 1.1 1 .1. and so in this way you can do these things and and here I want to tell you something uh, now I'm going to tell you about the precedence here is first of all comment it here I'm gonna create another variable and then I will comment it here is Z and it is equal to 2 and here is so now there is another variable is declared and it have the value 2 so now I am going to perform more than one operation with on three elements like here is comment it but here is this and now here is I am going to perform x plus y then minus z so now here I'm gonna sh short their values so we can understand it clearly. Here is four four. Uh, otherwise we have to uh, we need uh, we have to take more time to perform the addition, and so uh, it it is easy. So now so now here you can see that uh, it is x plus y and then minus z. So now here I'm gonna make it static then it will uh, be okay so now here i want to tell you something that is precedence so now here what operation we want to perform here uh, we want to perform the operation the first x plus y and then multiply the result of the x plus y with the z but here I want to tell you something this is not going to happen this is the right thing but it's not going to happen because uh, why it is not going to work because precedence so first of all what is the precedence the precedence is just a simple thing it is related to the priority here I'm going to tell you about the precedence a static and static and division symbol have more precedent precedence have more priority than then minus and plus so uh, now I hope you understand precedence is just the priority the math give more priority to the multiplication sign and the division sign than the minus and plus symbol so that's why uh, first uh, this part is not going to execute at the first y and z multiply then their result is added into the x and that is the wrong strategy that is the wrong thing and now here you will see the result 12 because at the first 4 is multiplied with the 2 and it will be uh, 8 and then 8 is added into the 4 and then it will be 12 so that is the wrong thing always in the math we all we also we all always need to perform the mathematical operation from the left side but here you see that at the first this multiplication uh, work then it will add uh, it will perform the addition so that is wrong in this way you have to use the parentheses like these parentheses you have to specify what part you want to execute first here you see that uh, I have write the parentheses around the x plus y so this part will be executed at the first the priority the precedence is neglect by the browser now uh, x plus y is become 8 and uh, th then it will be multiplied by z then it will be 16 so now here is the correct result uh, you have to place the brackets when you are op uh, using more than one operator when you are using more than one operands and uh, now I hope you understand Bra parentheses you can write the parentheses around any operand or operator but uh, it is used to decide the precedence at the first this multiplication have more precedence precedence but now uh, by placing these parentheses this part will be executed first and it have more precedence so 
thank you for watching this video i hope you get the knowledge if you have any problem so kindly add the discussion i will help you as much as i can and in this way you can also perform on other things like here is uh, you can also perform like this you can use uh, any uh, variable here is any operand so here is the result here i want to tell you something this multiplication sign and the division sign have the equal priority but its priority is more than the priority of minus and plus minus and plus have the equal priority but lower than the multiplication and division so thank you for watching this video i'll see you in the next video